surprise teams. Yeah, it was a surprise when the Foxes got off to an 0-3 start. The last month and a half, it's been business as usual for Dutch Fork. The seven-time state champions hosted JL Man tonight, looking to advance to the 5A title game. Dutch Fork is our number five team in our Midlands top 10. First quarter action, Dutch Fork has it fourth and goal from the one, but JL Mann stops Ethan Alfing for a two yard loss. That's a turnover on downs and a bad break right here for Dutch Fork. They fumble the punt. The Patriots recover at the Silver Foxes 19 yard line. Ethan Anderson to Toby Wilkins. JL Mann has it first and goal in the one. And that sets up the first touchdown of the night. The Patriots take a 7-0 lead. Dutch Fork will tie it on this 11-yard run by Trey Starks. Dutch Fork 7, J.L. Mann 7. But the Patriots respond with a pair of touchdown passes by Anderson. The uh, Patriots lead 21-7 at the half. All right, John Hunt had to replace the injured offing at quarterback. He threw three picks in the second half, but he's on the money there, connecting with Boyk and Bickley to pull the Foxes within two late in the fourth, 30 to 28. The Silver Foxes with a second left, a Justin Welsh 39-yard field goal, wins it for Dutch Fork in dramatic fashion, 31 to 30. They move on to the 5A state championship game. You know, we played about as bad as we possibly could at first, and but we just kept battling. We did some really good things. Uh, number four, single-handedly, and the quarterback kept them in the ball game. And uh, once we started stopping the run a little bit, we got a little bit better on defense. We came out second half lights out on defense, and uh, we just kept battling on offense. We can't make that many turnovers and win. We shouldn't have won the ball game, but. Uh, uh, Justin Welsh's money, you know, I just knew it was going to be good. He's money. We got it down there, and I knew he was going to make it. The other five.